Hey guys, we're back for another round of Monday Monties. And I'm here with my fiance, and I'm the Coffee Pink, also known as Sherry Witchery, but I've changed my name recently, so that's the major update for today. Um, my channel link is now the Coffee Pink at YouTube. So I went under a name change, and now I have an official logo for our channel. Thank you for all the subscribers that have been following us lately, and let's get right to it. I'll let him go first. Okay, so I've been pretty much all around thinking and all this, and this is the first thing I was going to say. Before I start anything, I am still going for the whole white crunch thing because I want it to be instead of seasonally. Because even still then, for that. even then, I have still not found one seasonally and all that. So I'm basically just gonna bring it back for like I want it back every single day. I mean, even if people get sick of it, I will never will. You I mean in the U.S. or just in general, like in stores? I mean, all in stores. I mean. In general stores, you want to see them whenever you get to the shopping line and look on the side and say, oh, look, there's normal crunch, then there's dark crunch, and then there's white crunch. <laughs> and it's like, why not all three, huh? Because they have all those other ones in there. They have Milky Way, Dark, and all those other types. So why can't we just have white crunch back? I mean, I don't even see them in December. That's the sad part. I looked everywhere and stuff one day and stuff. I never found those things. It's like you can only buy them online now. But anyhow, other than that, and certain events and stuff, well, well, no, 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 let me put that another way. In terms of basically the white crunch thing, I've decided to pretty much go with a bit of a white crunch candy craze point too, just because I love white chocolate. The thing about white chocolate is it's just different. It's got this sweet taste and stuff. It's more flavorful to it's me. It's a softer taste than, yeah. say, like milk chocolate or dark chocolate. Yeah. Is what he's trying to say. <laughs> like if you want something and stuff and you just eat a regular candy bar that's like dark chocolate or just regular milk chocolate, it's gonna feel like uh, just one candy bar made me feel like oh cool. But white chocolate it feels like you can eat that over and over and over again because it's one of those little white flavors. It's a nice variety for like having a different flavor than you normally have. Don't judge me. <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, fine. I'm gonna start out with these things that I found and stuff in the store this time around. Okay, which one are you going to start with? <clears throat> Since there's only this one. Okay. These Lindor white chocolates right here. These things I haven't opened up. These things I just now saw. And they're white chocolate truffles. I know. Yeah. I've, I've, I've never seen the white chocolate truffles. I've tried the other type of truffles in the last videos. How many ounces? 5.1 ounces. Of truffles, chocolate. They're yeah. really good. And I know what you're saying. Oh, you guys are buying that fancy stuff. Well, it's fancy, but at the but same time. But it was only $2.99. Exactly. So it's worth it. <laughs> at her local store. So yeah. it's not that bad. It's not too bad. I mean, and the original have... kind that he's talking about is this kind the Lindor milk chocolate truffles that I have. As well as, they also have sea salt, but I don't have them. I remember eating sea salt. Yeah, it's sea salt is really good. <laughs> it's um, still milk chocolate though, so it's still good. Wow, even the bag smells pretty strong. What's it taste like? I haven't tasted it yet. Are you going to taste one? Yeah, I guess. I'll let you be the taste tester today. <laughs> oh gosh. Kill me. Oh, <laughs> look at this. It, it looks is... like a little bit of a tennis ball. Actually, it looks like one of Mine the is like ping pong balls. I'm just going to show you guys this. Mine is dented on the side. Like what? Like what happened to the ball? It's okay <laughs> to have some dent products when it comes to chocolate. This chocolate just melts right over there. I know, but wow! Oh. <laughs> you guys gotta see this. Wow! Looks like it was what a the shower. hell happened to this? Compared to this one. I know, like, right? Like, what happened to this thing? I swear, it looks like an eyeball. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> anyhow, so real. anyhow, I'm going to try it. Right. I'm just saying, like, my oh, It's white chocolate inside, too. But it's really, really creamy and soft. Same with this one. It's milk chocolate, but it does the same thing. It just melts instantly as the minute it hits your tongue. Holy crap, man. This might be the best ones I've seen yet. I'm going to have to buy like thousands of these things. Thousands of 
Definitely improving this time. If you haven't anybody tried this before, let us know. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you ever had it before. I understand this isn't part of Nestor and all that and stuff, but it still represents chocolate as a whole. That's one thing. And for two, it's pretty dang good. So, I know a lot of people are on a budget and stuff, and they probably wouldn't buy this thing. But say if you ever have like three dollars and like, oh, I need some chocolate, but you wanna you wanna get something very good and stuff, and you feel like, oh, that was a wonderful day. I want some chocolate. This <laughs> thing right here, it. really? This thing right here is good. I'm trying to practice my people. It's exquisite. It's, it's, so <laughs> it's a fancy flavor of delicious flavor that's in your mouth. At any rate. <laughs> Yeah, this is a good one. Okay. You're next. <laughs> I already went. You're after day or another one. Time, so. I know we did. Know. The one that I got was the another Lynch product, as you can see, but it's a touch of sea salt and it's dark chocolate. Ooh. And it's a big bar. You can see it like it's paws my head. <laughs> And he's gonna show off one of his. Well, next one I got is pretty classic for everybody. Why don't you show yours? I am. Which one? Oh. The same one. Oh, well, Your yeah. version. Good point. She got the dark chocolate, and here I am with the white chocolate. You guys remember these. Oh, <laughs> Lint Classic Recipe White Chocolate. And they're 4.4 ounces each. I can't help but love these. Oh my god, they're also $2.99, which whenever is was, amazing. Whenever I was a kid, <laughs> a long time ago and stuff, all I was eating was the regular chocolate bars and all that. But whenever I first tasted chocolate, white chocolate, it was in a pretty much crunch bar. That's and true. I loved it. I went insane over it. Every single time my mom had like something like food stamps or regular money and stuff, I would ask her over and over for it and I would cry over the kids. But it was that good. It was that good. White chocolate is really good. I mean, <laughs> it's like an undiscovered country for me. <laughs> At any rate. An undiscovered country. Really? It was good. Okay, you're going to go rate, first. Other than the white chocolates, I found some interesting things that were pretty much over there, too. And we bought all this at Kroger's, just so you know. Like, Kroger is our local grocery store. One of them. Kroger's and Walmart. Kroger, Walmart, Aldi's, a lot of different stores. At any rate, I'm a big fan of some caramel, so I wanted to see what these tasted like too. Vanilla cream soft caramels. Uh, I didn't know they were vanilla cream, mm -hmm. but it might be still good. But this is what they are: vanilla cream soft caramels. Yay! And they are 5.5 ounces, and they were also two ninety nine. Yeah, all right, for price. <laughs> what is with this? Is the two ninety nine? See, I have no idea. I understand the two ninety nine thing. I mean, but think about it. This, this is, is so chocolate. good chocolate that you're not going to eat a lot of it at once unless you're like a chocolateholic. This is the chocolate rich so, people yeah. have. This is the kind of chocolate that, um, well, maybe rich people for you, but like my grandparents had this kind of chocolate, and it's the kind that like it's so rich that you don't eat a lot of it at once, so it lasts for a long time. I see why they don't want us to have it. I can't even open the bag. <laughs> I'll try. Oh my goodness. You want me to help you? See, I don't even know if you can do it. Anyhow. Okay. Watch as I put in the shade. Maybe. See? I'm telling you. Oh my god, why? <laughs> well, maybe. Hang on. I'm going to get this one. Ha! I win. <laughs> I put it to Jay. Exactly. Wow. <laughs> I did. Anyhow, it's just so reminding me of those um, caramel treats and stuff. What kind of that? Oh, they look like coffee. Those little candy treats a like long time ago. They look like saltwater taffy. Yeah. yeah. That's what they were bringing me I remember saltwater taffy. Because they're wrapped in like plastic wrap. I saw that at the store like too. Like wax paper is what I'm thinking of. Not plastic wrap, sorry. I know all this stuff together <laughs> does come to an expensive amount, but... Yeah, but we had it at the time, and we just kind of went a little crazy and wanted to show off. Right if you have it at the time, you should do it. That's if you have saying. it, have fun with it. Treat exactly. yourself once in a while, because it's good to treat yourself and make yourself feel good. We didn't need to treat ourselves in a long time, so. Yeah, this is probably going to last us a month. Mm. <laughs> yeah, it's how the taste. Mm. 
Not too bad. Not too great. I think the vanilla flavor overpowers you. Probably because you were expecting plain caramel and you're not a big fan of vanilla. True. I was expecting regular caramel. <laughs> well, I'll go ahead and show my next find from here while he's enjoying his caramel. I found a six pack of Mentos for $30. Two ninety. This is also, ironically, this is also two ninety nine. <laughs> but I got an open Mentos. Yay, Mentos! And I need to turn it sideways so you can see. I've been eating a little bit of it. But I think pretty much everybody knows what these are, but I'm still going to show it for those who might not. It's like everybody loves this stuff. I guess they're basically fruit flavored mint for those who maybe aren't familiar with it or don't have it in there. The funny Play. thing is, they used now, to be called chewing gum and stuff a long time ago. Chew. They, yeah, they still have the chewing gum, right? Yeah. I know. I know, but they're, they're just not chewing they gum. They're just chewy. Like, I'll show you. Like, they're little, like, capsules like this. This you one's actually it. pink, but you can't see it very well because my lighting right now is super bright because of daylight. But, um... Yeah, they're basically fruit flavored mint and they come in different flavors. Like this one comes in lemon, strawberry, and orange. And we give it to him so he can taste it for you and see what the strawberry tastes like. Does it taste like strawberries? Is it chewy? I wasn't down the super breath freshness, but No, but they make your breath smell fruity and they taste good. If you eat enough of them. Every time, <laughs> makes me think, what if this guy just robbed the bank, held up the Mentos, and then he got away with it? You have to chew them kind of hard because they have that hard capsule on the outside of them, but. Remind me a lot it's of going to take a while, so I'm going to let him take over. Kind of remind me a lot of them. Uh, uh, what's those things? They're a little Skittles. hard at first, but they get softer over time. They remind me of Skittles and stuff, except they're like. Yeah. They're like giant Skittles, yeah. Yeah. Which is another thing I've never seen. If you've ever seen giant Skittles or anything, you guys have got to show me a picture of it. If you ever see them, even if you got a name of it down in the in the box and stuff in the comments, you got to show me. Speaking of giant, giant Skittles. show me your next one, the red one. The red one? Oh yeah. You mean the Kit Kat bar? The massive Kit Kat bar, is extra large. It's so giant. Look how big this is. Okay. It's got so it's many size bars. comparison. Look at my head. It's got so <laughs> many bars in it too. It is huge, and look how many bars are in this thing. Um, I don't know. It's 4.5 ounces per three finger serving. Has 160 calories, so about like one. It has four servings per container, so um, a lot. A lot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. It has four servings per container, so it would be the size of like four Kit Kat bars, regular ones. I think that's a nice That's one. huge. <laughs> I had one before, but I ate mine. Sorry. I ate mine over the weekend. Yeah, I'm going to show my dark Ghirardelli. If I said that wrong, please tell me because I have no idea how to pronounce it. But it's chocolate squares and they're dark chocolate raspberry and they have raspberry filling in it and they are amazing. <laughs> they melt away like in your mouth and then they have raspberry filling and it tastes just so good with the dark chocolate because it's so tart that the chocolate actually makes it taste sweet. I love candy like that. Then I'm going to show you one because I needed to open this anyway. <laughs> those candies like that remind me a lot of If I love. can. Oh my god. Look how much glue is on this thing. <laughs> Because I can't open it. I can't open the job. Help. <laughs> These candies remind me a lot of those little crackers. I'm not kidding about the glue. You know, it is super glued on there. These candies remind me. I love the filling inside of it too. I love candies that have filling inside of it because those are usually like the favorite ones. Because you can like, if you don't like the outside, you can just eat the inside. Just say, okay, okay. throw the inside, it's up the inside. Suck the inside out <laughs> and throw the outside. Barely. <laughs> anyway. She struggles with that. I guess I'll show you my next one since she's almost out of the show. And then when he gets that open, I'll show you what they look like. But um, my other one is a classic. Gummy bear! 
pretend I got home this giant bag of home for five ninety nine. It's Haribo Old Bears. The original since how old? Nineteen. Can you see the year nineteen twenty two? I can't see the year, but I am so I've heard so many horror stories about the sugar free versions of these. But like I wanna try the natural one and see if it does the same thing. So this is a party size bag. It is twenty eight point eight ounces, aka one point eight pounds. And supposedly when you eat two pounds of any variety of carbo gummy bears, you get like Results, yeah, so I'll let you know what happens <laughs> after I eat them. That's gonna be my challenge for the weekend. <laughs> no, that's terrible. Anyhow, yay, he got it open, guys. Anyway, um, let's see. This is the little square dark chocolate raspberry, and I'm going to eat them because he will not taste them. So he hates raspberry. Uh, it's more like dark chocolate. Well, it's the combination of two things it. I want to eat. He doesn't like raspberries either. Mm. See how good it is? It it's really amazing. It reminds me a lot of those candies and stuff. Y'all ever heard of those chocolate covered carrots, those cherries and stuff? And those and those are good. Those were for Valentine's Day, but Very I love cordial. those too. It reminds me of those too, but it's a square, which is pretty awesome. Take a better bite. So I know there's a better over. version out there too, probably like strawberry. But at the same time, I was pretty much. Now, here's I what happened. It. I'm going to tell you straight up before I finish everything up. Okay. What happened was we were going to regularly shop for normal things and all that. And we did. When we got in the candy aisle, we couldn't help ourselves and just decided to grab everything and stuff. And if like, we wouldn't have moved out of that aisle real quick, we would have, probably would have grabbed even more than this. It we was, did, admittedly, but we also bought our regular groceries. Exactly. But see, First. you're very, I understand, because I mean, like, everybody's like that. I know y'all probably had that happen before where, oh my gosh, look at all the candy sitting down here and here. Ah, oh, go crazy and stuff. Or just imagine being that aisle of all your favorite things that you love to snack on. Yeah. And then picture it being a massive aisle on both sides, and that's exactly what happened. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> everything was giant size for the most part, too. Even before this, I found like, even more giant. They are all at least two pounds. Yeah. Oh, stuff. I don't know how much you can eat to get sick or how many sides. Anyhow, though, <laughs> um, my last and not least is this new thing I found at Walmart. Everybody's going to try. The Milky Way Fudge. I like chocolate, I like the caramel, and I like the fudge. So let's see if they look together, work together better. I'm also honestly thinking if they had something crunchy in between that stuff, it would be a lot better, like a little bit of a crunchy bar and stuff. But I think they already have that. I know they have it, I just can't find it. Probably back in that candy aisle. I don't know, it was up at the front when we got it, so we were at self checkout. So. <laughs> but this is two bars of this stuff. You have Holy to cow, it. this is strong. This smells like a regular Milky Way, but yeah. Try a better bite than that. Oh, yeah. Try a better bite than that. This is a better bite. You can it. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> do you like it at least? Yeah, I do. Apparently he does because he eats it. Well, we're going to stop there and wave you guys off. Um, that's our Monday Munchies edition for this week. And have a good day, guys. Love you. Bye.